Motivation, because I think it's one of the most thrown out words. People are saying motivation sucks. So motivation doesn't suck. One, motivation gets you to do the things that you wanna do quicker. If you didn't get motivated to do anything, you'd be doing nothing, procrastinating. Motivation is fucking key to start building better habits and then eventually become disciplined enough. So then when motivation comes around, it's like, fuck yeah, I'm at the next level. This motivation is gonna push me to the next level and get me to do the shit that I've always wanted to do. The whole world at the moment glorify getting so much work done in a day. If you do a full week of even 16 to 18 hours a day, by the end of the week, you're fucked. Everybody has the exact same goals, right? Nobody wants to be poor. Everybody wants to be able to afford to go do the things they wanna do. Everybody wants to buy nice things but nobody wants to do the boring shit over and over, over and over, over and over, over to be able to do it for the rest of their life. But people are willing to work at a job they hate for the next 65 years, which I think is boring. I've been in construction for 12 years now, almost 13 years. I had a steel fabrication company. We were working like 28 hour shifts straight, like it was fucking intense, but that was to get the business off the ground. That business is a multi-million dollar company. I sold out a bit too early, but I don't care because I have goals that don't relate to being in that industry. Going to work every day for eight to 12 hours is boring shit. And everybody, just because they get instant gratification for working every single day because they get a weekly paycheck, but you gotta do it for 65 years. And you will never, unless you invest right, you're gonna stay poor for the rest of your life. You're gonna get to 65, get your super, and then you're gonna only be getting like 800 bucks a week to live for the rest of your years, which are meant to be your golden years. You'll pay back to, from society to live out your best life in your older age. It's the same as working out. Nobody wants to go to the gym every day. Nobody wants to eat healthy because it's hard, because it sucks. Eating shit foods makes you feel better instantly, and then shit. If you get motivated for something, you need to get in the mindset of those activities aren't sustainable over a long period of time. You want to move out of society where you get this wow. dopamine hit from TikTok. You get this dopamine hit from all these likes you get. You, you post one video on TikTok and it can go viral of you eating a fucking sandwich. You can give yourself a form of instant gratification by creating smaller goals to complete each week. It'll one, it'll make you feel better that you, if you have a list of things you wanna get done for the week and by the end of the week you've got them all done, you'll automatically get this dopamine hit and be like, fuck yeah, I got that shit done. That's the type of gratification you need to be chasing, not this instant fame or instant money because it, in the long run, it just doesn't exist. You know the iceberg fucking um, painting that everybody's seen, it's like success, money, fame, freedom, but then, that's all everybody sees. All this stuff underneath, nobody sees because it's always in the back end. It's always grinding, it's training all the time. And people will be like, if I don't look like that in a year, I'm not doing it anymore. I wanna give a few tips on how you can uh, capitalize, I guess, on that motivation that's coming in. Number one, make sure you plan a schedule of what's sustainable to you. Let's talk about gym, for instance. If you want to lose weight and get healthy, go to the gym as much as you want for the first week. It won't matter, but you know for that's not going to be sustainable. Even if you think right now when you get that motivation, it's going to be sustainable, it's not. So make sure you sit down, figure out how much time you have, where you can take fr time from, like watching Netflix, scrolling your phone, whatever. Just make sure you plan it out day by day or week by week, however you want to do it, and then stick to those goals. If it's three times a week, if it's two times a week, if it's one time a week, it doesn't matter. Just make sure you have a sustainable plan to put in place for when that motivation runs out. Number two, write down obtainable goals weekly. Every Sunday, every Monday, whenever you want to categorize your week, write down obtainable goals weekly so then when you get to the next Sunday, you've completed all those goals. This will give you another boost of dopamine, which will make you more motivated to keep going, and it'll also build that willpower tank. So make sure you're writing down obtainable goals weekly. Number three, last but not least, we want to increase that willpower tank by doing small daily tasks or activities that no matter what you can do every single day. You make them so small and take fuck all time so then you can complete them no matter what. If you get into bed and you haven't done your daily task, you can then get straight up, finish it because it's only been five to 10 minutes long. Whether that's a cold shower daily, 10 push-ups a day, 10 minutes of a workout a day, 10 minutes of learning how to play an instrument, or 10 minutes of reading. It doesn't matter. You just need to start increasing that willpower tank. And the only way we can increase the willpower, which is the energy we get 
when the whole, I don't want to do this, it's boring, I'm not seeing any progression, I'm not seeing any money coming in, when that feeling starts to kick in, if your willpower tank is big enough and full enough, that'll kick into overdrive and then get you to get off your ass and start doing those things. The only way we can increase our willpower tank is by doing things every single day, no matter what. And then doing them over and over again for a long period of time is gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. So then the next time you start a new task, you're gonna be taking away from a bigger willpower tank. So every time that it comes through and you go, I don't wanna do it, willpower is gonna go boom, let's get it done. Boom. I'm going to start doing more content like this. So please remember to like and subscribe. Let me know if you like this type of content or not. It's a lot short form because I want to try and teach people what I know. You don't have to do whatever the fuck I tell you to do, obviously. But I'm letting people know what I'm doing to create my successful, happy life. And I would want to bring everybody along. So I'm going to do more content like this. Please like and subscribe. And see you in the next one. Have a good week. Peace.